Hi there, this is Milo. Um, today I've got something special. A Master Lock number 19. Now, you might be thinking, Master Lock? <laughs> You're nothing special. Uh, this particular one is a vintage Master Lock that harks back to the days when Master Lock actually had some serious potential. Uh, this this lock is not to be sniffed at. It, uh, it's a behemoth for a start. Now, I don't know if this is doing it justice. So, um, what have I got? There's a... A Chubb Cruiser for comparison. Yeah, that's that's a big chunk of steel. Uh, the the shackle on the Master Lock nine, number nineteen is half inch, half inch diameter, so about thirteen, thirteen and a half millimeter. And uh, let me see, if, can I get a a lock that we all kind of recognise? An American lock. So I think we can see <laughs> you can almost pass the American lock. Almost almost pass it through the shackle. So yeah, just wow. <laughs> now uh, this isn't my lock. This lock is uh, has come to me in a package that I, I, I recently received, uh, I, I did a trade with Joe Picks, Locksport. Um, a link to, to Joe will be either up here in the corner. Um, and this lock is destined for somebody else. It's merely, I'm merely relaying it on. Um, I, wa I was told it would be a good opportunity to pick this rare beast. Um, and I did feel a bit awkward about it because it's it, you know it's it's meant for somebody else, um, but I was assured you know uh, it's a rare lock. I probably won't get many chances to pick a lock like this, so um, I'm incredibly honoured to to be given this opportunity. Um, yeah, so I won't be uploading this video until after uh, the recipient gets it. I, uh, I'll be posting it onwards uh, in a day or two when I'm back to work. Um, so after he's received it and and made his video then I'll, I'll feel better about about posting uh, this video. But yeah, so let's give it a pick. Now it weighs, it probably weighs over a kilo this thing. It's, uh, <laughs> it's huge. So I'm going to use top of the keyway tension. Uh, firm, but you know, not not too heavy. And I'm going to take the the Jimmy Longs for a for a wee test run. Um, I've not used Jimmy Longs before, so right, we click on one. Um, just looking for binders. So I've got a paracentric keyway and fairly decent tolerances in this core. It's uh, it's not, you know, it's not the average uh, master lock for for sure. Um, two, three, there we go. And what a shackle spring! <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not. It's not your average master lock. Um, it's it's a beast. It's an absolute beast. Uh, I'm like I say, I'm I'm truly honoured to 
to be given the, the opportunity to to even see this thing in, in the flesh. It's uh, I've seen videos on YouTube. Uh, DMAC did one, Joe Pix did one recently. Um, and it, it is a, it's a beast. It's an absolute beast. Uh, this particular rock, uh, lock will be headed to Roy Salmon. So the, I'll put a link to Roy's channel down below. And yeah, I... Um, what can I say? Thank you, guys. Uh, fantastic community. Absolutely f fantastic. I know we say it all the time, but crikey, it's it's true. Um, I'm stoked about getting the opportunity to pick this beast. And, uh, yeah, I'll be packing it up and sending it to its new home. And there we go. The Master Lock, number 19. Oh, what could have been? Oh, what could have been? <laughs> and it's built built from the same, you know. It's it's a block from the nineteen seventies, so you know they they built things tough in the seventies. <laughs> I might be a bit biased, but uh, anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good one. Cheers.